this, just bring the night out. Try and not lose track of, mind you, I like the noise because you can tell when the moves so I'll, I'll have to concentrate. And uh, let's bring this bishop out. Attacking the knight. Forgotten what I was just going to say. Okay, so they've gone for like a double. So it's like a reverse um, fried liver type situation. It's one of the two things that can happen here. Because if we let the knight come in here, he's got a check, so he's going to get the rook. So we could bring the rook across. Then the bishop comes and take and comes for the queen. So they get the pawn either way. So shall we let them have the pawn and improve our position elsewhere on the board? Interesting situation. Let's do that. Let's bring the rook here. So the motor set to still continue because they'll be like, whoa, this is fantastic. I'm hitting the queen. I'm going to get his rook. Sacrificing two pieces for the rook. Bishop takes, rook takes, knight takes, queen takes. They haven't done that just yet, but they've still got time to do that. Yeah, so a smaller piece attacking higher piece to say, well, what are you doing? And they've actually kind of not gone for it. Interesting times. I wonder why they went all that way down there. Then that was a bit of a waste, wasn't it? And so there's only one piece on there. So if we take, then the pawn is on the knight. Sweet. Wow, oh, it's gone with the bishop. Crikey, this player is not doing anything, we think. Let's go and attack the bishop. Knights on the bishops. This bishop doesn't have any protection, so we might have to get it moved out of the way. It does have an x-ray through to the queen, but it's saying no. You've had your fill. Let's bring here bait some more. And the bishops move back. Right, am I losing on time here or something? I'm missing something, aren't I? I'm actually just going to attack the bishop now. I'm getting tired of it. And okay, not interested. So we'll go here. White square bishop, probably just drop it back a bit. And then really go for a bit of castling. Unless there's something better. Oh, he's going for the pawn attacks. Okay, let's push the pawn up. Let's block it. What am I seeing? This pawn pushing onto this pawn looks interesting. Let's do that. Try and open up the rook if we can. Let's take. Queen's probably taking. Just looking at some disruption. Uh, no, it's not having any of that either. It's blocking our knight's passageway, but the knight's got a nice position here, but I bet he drops the pawn to stop it. Just going to continue on, attacking, bishop probably takes, could take with the rook, could take with the pawn, rooks don't have any place in the centre of the board, but I'm taking it and I'm bringing it back. Unless there's something better. We have an x-ray through which the opponent's given us to their king. We haven't castled yet. The queen's got a lot of dancing room, actually. Small piece attacking. That's obviously happening. It's not too great a position. Queen, queen. Can get to the king somehow. That might be a help. Looks like the opponent might have left the game. That's an interesting situation. We're equal on material and stuff. Queen coming. I don't think they have anything major to worry about. But we'll claim victory on that. Quick look at the evaluation. It should just show even. Ooh, minus two. We're not doing too bad. Excellent. 